Having rented the same condominium for six years, Anshu wanted to upgrade and move to a location with more facilities for her son to enjoy. But finding a home that was convenient, spacious, and within budget turned out to be an impossible task. You know, you get on those websites and you start looking at a particular range. The apartments that were showing up were those which were pretty much going for, like, let's say. 40% lesser maybe a year back and everything that we wanted had pretty much al- almost doubled Anshu's case is not isolated data from property listing portal 99.co shows that home rents have been rising in Singapore over the course of the pandemic when we look at the private housing sector uh, which is uh, the condo so for rents uh, they've been rising for 18 consecutive months in fact since uh, December 2020 and the total increase over this period is uh, about Twenty-nine percent. Uh, likewise, for the public housing, uh, which is uh, which we call HDB flats, uh, rents are rising uh, continuously for an even longer period for twenty-four straight months. Demand from returning expats as borders reopen and locals moving out of their parents' homes or upgrading to bigger apartments are some of the reasons behind the surge. There are also more locals renting because uh, they have bought uh, new condos or new public housing flats. And uh, because of the supply chain disruptions, there has been some delay in terms of the completions. Analysts have further attributed the government's cooling measures from December last year as one of the reasons behind the hike. These measures require buyers to pay additional stamp duty if they already own a property in Singapore. So in order to avoid paying the tax, many of them, they have uh, sold their flats and they have rented in the interim. Industry insiders predict that housing rentals will continue to rise for the rest of the year and will only ease up in 2023 when the pending construction projects are completed. Foreigners like Anshu are worried that the city-state might lose its appeal if rents continue to rise. But others argue factors such as strong rule of law, sound infrastructure, and a good health and education system will continue to hold Singapore in good stead in the years to come.